Ag Promo Source is a unique group of marketing specialists with one mission, help your ag business grow. Each affiliate has their own area of expertise and they work together to bring you advice, products, and services. To get started, visit agpromosource.com. Ag Promo Source, together we grow. This segment brought to you by Kansas Regenerative Medicine Center. Your stem cells, your health, your life. And we're back again. This is Around Kansas. I'm Frank. I'm still Deb. And we're doing all these big goodies today. So one of my favorite places, and it has been ever since I moved to Kansas, is of course the Charles Curtis House. And if you recall, we did a 15-minute documentary on Charles Curtis a few months back. And that is available online at the Kansas Humanities Council website. So if you go to their website and you look at, um, I think, films, um, you can find Our Charlie listed on their films and you can watch it. And we encourage you to do that. Share it with your students if you're a teacher or you know club meetings. If you want one of us to come and talk about it, we'll be glad to with your group. So the Curtis House is just a treasure and God bless Donna Nova Cottrell for saving it. And it is open for tour by appointment but in the meantime, you can go back with us and take a look at it. Charles Curtis was born in a cabin that no longer stands on the north side of the Kansas River in 1860. He lived in various homes and maybe even a teepee throughout his colorful life. In 1907, as he became more successful as a lawyer and politician, he purchased a mansion on the corner of 11th and Topeka Boulevard, a home possessing a fine view of the Kansas State House. His neighbor on the corner to the north was Arthur Capper, publisher, governor, and U.S. Senator. The Charles Curtis home is an example of a rather unique and distinctive residential architecture incorporating bulbous domes, Romanesque arches, and Renaissance massing. It is an early example of eclecticism in Kansas building. Though he did not originally design the house, famed Philadelphia architect Seymour Davis made later alterations. The mansion has exceptional chandeliers, ornamental plaster, a grand staircase, parquet floors stained and jeweled glass windows, and four fireplaces, two white oak, one solid cherry, and one of Italian marble. According to the State Historical Society, the house has more intact parquet flooring than any other historical house in Kansas. It was once described as not surpassed by any residents in the city. Its purchase by Don and Nova Cottrell likely saved it from the fate of many of its sister mansions along the boulevard that have fallen to the wrecking ball. The mansion has a large collection of historical memorabilia and artifacts, and it is furnished with antiques, some from the Curtis family, as well as some of the Curtis memorabilia. The Cottrells maintained the house as a museum to Curtis's legacy. It was placed on the National Register in 1976. Valley Vet Supply is devoted to providing information and professional quality products at reasonable prices. Valley Vet. 